back to the Oz Moto Show. Lucky Me has been sent north to the launch of the KTM 2023 motocross range at the iconic Conondale motocross track with Penrite Pro MX MX2 racer Nathan Crawford. Because someone's got to teach him how to race. <laughs> Let's go find Nathan and check out these beasts. to be out here in Conondale Motocross Track launching this exquisite range of KTMs behind us. Yeah, it's really good, obviously. Yeah, like you said, we're out here at Conondale. It's pretty much, I think, in my eyes, the best track that we have out as far as, you know, venue goes. We've got the hills, the mountains, and everything like that. So I think it's an unreal track. And, um, yeah, obviously, we're out here launching the new 23 KTM, so really couldn't, have, couldn't really be having a better day. Totally. Now, before we get onto the bikes, let's talk about round six. Uh, your first race back uh, at the national levels in six months, your debut out with KTM. How, how did it go? Was it fantastic to get back out there and, and race in anger again? Yeah, really, it couldn't have gone any better. I mean, I had basically one mistake that I wasn't happy with all day, but, you know, that was just a little tip over in the first race. But, you know, it didn't really change my overall um, result for the end of the day. So on the podium in second was, like, basically best-case scenario for me coming back off a six-month injury. So. You know, everything with the team ran super smooth. I really couldn't have asked for anything more from them guys and obviously the patience that they've given me over the last six months too to let me do my thing and get, get better. So um, I really couldn't have asked for a better weekend there. Yeah, okay, well, let's talk about the bikes because we've got this beautiful range behind us. Uh, there's six different models. 250, 450s, I mean you're a 250 guy, give yeah. us your take on the, on the two new 250s that they've displayed here. Yeah, well like you said, we've obviously got um, six different models, range from 125 all the way up to 450, we've even got the 300 two-stroke which is good, but as you said, yeah, my, my picks are the 250F and 250 two-stroke. Um, the new 250F actually feels really good, the engine itself, the way it runs and how clean it is and it just feels really nice and free and that's a cool thing. For me, um, while I love the 250F, I'm a, I definitely like the two-strokes, um, so I've been spent most of my time on the two-stroke today. Um, and something new with the 250 two-stroke, they have a, a, rev limit, a rev limiter now which is new to the bike, um, which I think is pretty unique, especially for a two-stroke. So um, yeah, that, that bike's been a lot of fun, honestly. I've ridden all the bikes today and, and I haven't disliked any of them. So really good for me I think they look good but how do they ride I guess is, is my next question well we're out here at Conondale so you're gonna have to get out there on the track and see for yourself <laughs> Conondale Motocross Track and for the first cab off the rank for me, I've chosen the 250 SXF. We're about to go out on a siding lap and I'm going to send it really slowly. Now, two stroke and four as the KTM line goes. I reckon I'm ready to race. 